Hello family, hope everyone is fine, hope everyone is doing well. I want to also wish everyone a very Merry Christmas and a prosperous New Year. This is the behind the scenes of our production during um, when Mabna came for her recording. I, I, I promise to give you the behind the scenes of everything and um, today I want to I want to go according to what I promised. Yeah, um, the, 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 the production started with the pre-production where we, we got the songs from the artist and arranged them. And then after arranging them, I sent it to my brother, that's Kofi Teddy, to also look at it and then come around so that we could have um, some kind of keyboard added to it and then see how it goes. So he came around and then we added some keyboards to the songs that was, was sent to us by the artist. Yeah. And then after that, um, I did some rearrangement from what the artist brought, and then sent it back to 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 her to to check if everything is okay. Yeah. So after we we met and then added the keyboard to it. Um, after that, um, I met the clergy team to for rehearsals of the song, and then send them the lyrics so that they will be conversant with the tunes and then the song yeah very well so that that was what was done before the day of the program so we we sat down to to talk about what will go through the program that's what will go through the production of the song and since we were on a tight budget we decided to make things simple but then a bit of classic yeah uh, like a classy something like that okay so the the team of instrumentalists was um that's the they were the team of instrumentalists were we decided to go with three keyboards that's kofi teddy on the piano and then um emmanuel Atta, dangote on the auxiliaries and then akosi jin sharp was on the bass guitar who is standing in for a brother that's um pax randy um, who is not with us right now? Yeah. So Akosi Jeep Sharp was on the on the bass, and then um, Kobe Drama Vata. Kobe was also on the drums, and then Mr. Odai was supposed to be on the guitars, but got a situation that needed to be attended to, so he was not able to come for the program. The situation was very critical, so we decided not to bring in any um, guitarist since it was the day of the program that we got that information from Mr. Odai who couldn't make it. So we decided to play it without any guitars so that the guitars would be done in the studio. Yeah, so that was the, the decision we, we took on that. All right, so. Um, after that, we made some kind of schedule with the artist so that when she comes around, um, we will meet her and then have some rehearsals with the instrumentalists, the, the singers and all those stakeholders involved. Yeah. So we met her when she landed in the country to have some couple of rehearsals with her and then it was very marvelous it was very powerful yeah i must say it was very powerful so after the rehearsals we we made her aware of the arrangements and the changes so that she will be able to be conversant with the song and then the arrangements of the song so during the day since it was a, a on a tight budget i was actually doing several stuff at the same time yeah i i I didn't delegate a lot yes so I took care of the the let's say the whole production management or the whole production direction here so um for for I did several stuff I was actually doing so many stuff due to that I made sure I would do what I can do earlier on first including the arrangement of the place of recording making sure that the stems that was made in the studio by the BVs were well arranged before 
it's being sent to the, the, the instrumentalist or yeah before it's being sent to the instrumentalist and I also made sure that the machine that was the laptop I was using to do the tracking was intact before I give it out to to my guy who will take care of the, the tracking and then um I also decided to have some small stage stuff as in the stage arrangement the lighting and the other setup yeah and since we were using that's my church the instrumental side of my church i decided to make that place very cool for the recording so that was what i did that was what i did for um the, before the, the the day of the recording if you actually saw me with a microphone um it wasn't for the purpose of singing yeah but then it was made us a talk back we actually had two talk backs um the pianist which is the band leader Kofi Teddy was using one and I was using one he was using his own to communicate effectively with the band as in the instrumentalist and um I was also using my microphone to talk to the um BV was um the the recording is in session yeah was the recording is in session including the artists too so that we will hear each other on that so that was the purpose for my microphone i was using during the recording and it wasn't for um musical purpose so by the time we started the recording i was only left with the coordinating of stuff with my camera guys so that we we can have it and this one wasn't like a program where everything is flowing it was just a recording so what we what we we did was that we will rehearse for like one two three or we will play like one two three and choose the best ones that was the decision i decided with um the instrumentalist and then the the bvs yeah that was it okay so it was very good it was very good taking that kind of decision the team were so tired yeah I can actually say that the team were so tired due to work and stuff and coming from work from that Friday morning like going to work on Friday morning and coming back and then coming to have such a tedious recording I could see that they were they were a bit tired but we did all we can to deliver by recording the best by delivering the 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 the, the kind of quality we could all have for the track to be very nice yeah so that was what we did so with the camera session i went with five cameras yeah where one takes care of the drama another takes care of the close-ups and one takes care of the other instrumentalists and the other two was for the whole team respectively like, that means some will take the area view and then the others will take the that's the whole team so that was what i i i I decided and that was what I communicated to my camera guys. Yeah. So we we had a very great experience with the recording. It was very 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 fantastic and I was very pleased with it as always. I always thank God for giving us such a committed team boys and girls, men and women who shows up even in an abnormal moment when they are called and then they were very marvelous. God bless them always. God bless them. Marian, um, Janet, Abigail, um, Peps, and, and all those guys, all those guys. And my boys, Kenneth and Godfred. They were they were very, 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 very committed that day. Even though they were tired from work and those stuff, but they were very committed. And I thank God for that. I I I, I pray that may God bless them everywhere they, they they are and everywhere they find them so yeah so that was it for 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 the recording and then the recording aspect the the, the recording moments were very 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 good experience it was it was something we all enjoyed we all enjoyed something we enjoyed doing best and then we all enjoyed something we were doing for god and not for any man yeah so it was it was a whole lot of commitment from each and everyone from our hearts yeah 
and then after the recording we had some small drinks yeah as some small um night drinks and then i got them some place to to rest a bit before they all moved after the recording i think the next day we we decided to start the post production we brought in the files to the studio to check them out and then um pick the best audios out of the the lots we did yeah the songs were three songs and you could you can check up madness page on on spotify and the other streaming platforms yeah um it will come maybe next year yeah we are being hopeful that next year the songs will be released but madness have some couple of songs on spotify and and itunes and those various platforms yeah streaming platforms you get madness songs to stream and most of the songs were done by the team clergy yeah the production and then bvs yeah were done by the team yeah so we took in the best from the lot of recordings we did and then decided to work on it in the studio to see if there is any overdubs to play then we we call the guys to come and do and then if there is any kind of corrections to be made in the studio we will also make it and then that was it and we hope to bring out the best so that everyone will enjoy and it's it's a very powerful song the first song which is um delighted um we've done the studio version and it's on spotify when you check on madness page on spotify and itunes you you get it delighted a very brilliant song from the artist and it was done by the clergy and then um hong kong kron hong kong kron is one spirit filled song written by the artist which we we did the during the night yeah and it's it's a very powerful song you will love it when it it comes and then we did another bongo reggae song um um which is called um open my eyes one 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 song that personally speaks to me it's, it's a very nice song and i hope you also enjoy it very well when when it comes out when it comes out yeah um basically mabna is a new artist um who loves music who loves to sing and then we also decided to help her um bring out that kind of god's given talent and then that kind of um zeal in her we decided to make it happen and that's what we are doing and i'm praying that god helps her to bring out a good good songs to bring out good songs every time very good songwriter and I, i love the the kind of heart as to the songs and the stuff it's 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 very powerful it's very powerful having someone who speaks from um her heart even through her lyrics you could you could you could feel that kind of experience and i pray that god gives her the 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 ideas and then the wisdom to always write good songs so that we also come out with a good tunes and then good um, recordings to bless the world with it and then that was it that was it um you can follow our page um the clergy official on all platforms facebook theo scouts and the clergy instagram theo scouts and the clergy um tiktok theo scouts and the clergy and youtube the clergy official the clergy official may the lord shine his face on you in the name of jesus i pray that you be a blessing as you listen to our releases and as you listen to our songs um our ep is also coming that's next year our ep is coming um songs of prayer yeah that's the title of the ep songs of prayer and then i believe you will be blessed with this song all the songs are songs that will be used for prayer so it's a secret place songs so i believe you will be blessed by listening to these songs and then god will bless you let's 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 meet again for this kind of content any other time we meet god bless you family hey, no,
Il est le bon ça, 